TJ, looking back, um, how damaging was it to let a big lead get away against what's supposed to be the worst team in the league and really kind of set a bad tone for the weekend? Yeah, to, to have a 18 point lead in the first half and then they cut it to nine by the end of the first half and eventually the last four minutes of the game they got the lead and just controlled the game that that hurt us a lot and that that still like sits on us it's going to sit on us for the rest of the year on how hard that one hurt but that's just we just got to take it how it is we can't take it back and that's just a game we got to learn from and we got to now we have to learn how to play for 40 minutes and how to finish games DJ, uh, your team's been out rebounded Talk about that and the second chance points you've given both teams last couple of games. That's going to be something we're we're stressing for the rest the rest of the way is that we have to rebound. Not only we got to box out because we're not the biggest team in the league. We're not going to win the jumping battle, so we got to get in and put bodies on people and move people out the way so we can get rebounds. This is something we just have to stress the rest of the way. On another uh, note, uh, Alsandi, can I know the three spots been a little bit of very had 10 points, had some key points in the Valpo game yesterday. Talk about his growth in that three spot. Uh, Osandi, he, he's came a long way from the beginning of the season, from right before we left the Christmas break to right now. He's he's came a long way, and he's going to keep getting better and continue to learn at the stuff that he's not as well at now. And he, he's going to help us out a lot down the way, down the stretch. You just, I mean, you're a young team. It just seems like good. Does it sometimes take a few games in the Rising League for everybody to understand what it takes to win? Yeah, uh, we, we, we uh, us older guys tell everybody all the time that every, every game is going to be tough. There's not going to be any game that we're just going to come in and blow a team out of the water. Every game is going to be tough. We have to play for 40 minutes. And I think after this weekend, the new guys, the young guys, they really realize that now. And they realize that in order to do what we want to do, we just got to continue to keep playing hard and we can never let up. Um, we, we're going to talk about Wright State today in practice, so I don't know much about them now. I know they have uh, one of their leading scorers and rebounders is pretty good, so we just got to gonna have to put a body on him if we want to win this game. Is it a mental thing as far as rebounding is concerned, or is it just watching the shot instead of finding that body? I mean, it was 20 was the being out-rebounded by Valpo. What does it take to to get that number down and kind of start winning those rebounding battles? Uh, it, really, it really just takes putting a body on people. I think with us sometimes the shot goes up and then we all just look at the rim or we just look at the ball or instead of putting a body on somebody, we all we just try to go jump and get it. And we're, we're a small team. We're not going to win the jumping battles with anybody. So I, I guess you could say it's more of a mental thing. We just got to go put a body on somebody. That's really all it is. What was Coach like after this weekend? <laughs> uh, he was pretty upset. I mean, we, we were all pretty upset, but he, he made a good point, though. We're, we're a better team before we left for Christmas break. We're a better team now than we were then. And as long as we keep progressing, we're nowhere near where we want to be now, but as long as we keep progressing and keep seeing improvement, we feel that we're going to be what we want to be down the stretch. How about your own play, especially from the three line? I mean, you developed a lot better. Uh, I'm just I'm just taking what the defense giving me. I feel like a lot they're they're giving me the shot because I feel like I can get to the hole, so they're giving me the shot. And if it's open, I'm just gonna go for it and just take it.